Jasmine deflationary mechanism equals platinum data utilization businesses, PDUBs, locking up coins. Target is 70% lockup of 35 billion coins. Quarter four, 2023, Jasmine becomes deflationary for the win. Yes, that would be amazing. So, you know, I was talking a few days ago. Um, I think it was maybe one of the last times I was with you guys. I was talking to Mike Cornwell on the phone about some of this stuff. But, you know, it's one thing to have the rest of the circulating supply come in, right? I think we're at 95%, so it's just only 5% left. It's like not even that big of a deal. But by having Jasmine become deflationary for all those who are fudding it in the past, it's going to be a real game changer. I'm going to blow this up a little bit. Um, it might be still a little bit harder for you to see it, but I'll show you guys this. So, you know, you have what you see on this particular uh, graph or chart for the market supply, period of popularization, period of growth in value, period of ecosystem expansion. Um, and, you know, mean technically speaking, I feel like we're going to get to that. I mean, any solid project, you want to have a thriving ecosystem, right? And then, of course, there's period of market establishment. And you just see this kind of like upward trend, if you will. I mean, it's just it's just a chart. But look what it says here. The key takeaway is period of market establishment, that far right one. So it says the undistributed balance of Jasmine coin will disappear due to the increase in data utilization business. With the disappearance of the undistributed amount, data utilization business will purchase Jasmine coin from the market. The amount of Jasmine coin in the market will decrease as data utilization business purchases, I should say, Jasmine in the market. All right. So, of course, you know, some people want to explain, you know, exactly what does this mean when they lock up 35 billion coins. And, of course, this guy has a response, which is cool. It's, it's nice that he recognized a legitimate question. And I'm sure some of you guys may be wondering about this as well, and that's why I'm addressing it. So he responds and he states, it means that for PDUBs to get access to platinum data, what Jasmine is basically selling, right? Let's face it, the democratization of data. You got data lockers and so on. Um, with AI inferences, they need to purchase Jasmine coin based on the amount of data in relation to JPY and lock it up in the ecosystem for a year or longer. Interesting. And of course, shout out to Frankie who watches our show and uh, he says best explanation by far. I would agree. That's not too shabby. Uh, here's another person who subscribed to us. Uh, pretty cool guy. Um, everyone's kind of like, man, this is interesting, right? And that's where I'm at with this. And if anything, if you guys pick this up on that particular dip into the fives, not too bad, right? I mean, um, you could get like 100,000 of these, right? Roughly for... Don't quote me on this, but at least under 600, anywhere from like 550 to 600 bucks. Um, that's not too bad, right? I mean, there's not a lot of projects you really do that. And then combine that with what's going to happen in June. Um, it's very bullish for Jasmine, not financial advice. Thank you so much for watching, guys. If you have not yet subscribed, do yourself a favor and subscribe for more information on the ISO 222 compliant tokens and hit the notification bell to make sure that you are aware of the new videos when they come up. Max and I cover these ISOs, and we also have a live show every single night at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Make sure you tune in for that. You won't want to miss it. Thanks again, and we will see you on the next video.